Hello there beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to On How channel. For people that don't know, my name is Anas, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop on below in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back and please be a witness for that for the over 100 videos. <laughs> over 150 videos I made so far on Shopify customization because they were mostly requested by you guys, I mean subscribers. And some people not even subscribers, but I'm fine with that. I still make the video for them. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. But actually, if you are interested in Shopify customization, you want to be an expert, you want to learn how to do anything yourself without having to hire a developer, why not subscribe to the channel, man? I don't have anything to sell. I don't sell any courses, never will. I don't have any paid memberships on the channel. Everything I do create, including the calls and the videos, I post them completely free on the channel. You just have to skip around some advertisements, but that's the case for most of the videos on YouTube, right? Including the entertainment ones you like to watch, which I don't create. I create some value for people that will help you in your future. But I respect your decision, not let you decide. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. Here I am again, back with another requested video, which is how to make the menu drawer on the mobile, taking the full page, just like the cart drawer because if you already know this the shopify store the menu drawer on the mobile it does not take the, it cover the whole page it keeps the header on top and it just covers like a part of the page and i got the request on how to make the menu drawer just like the cart drawer uh, covering the whole page i did provide them with the code i think or not yet i'm not sure i do remember that <laughs> i'm getting too many requests lately so i have to keep up but anyway, in this video, I will show you how to do that exactly and make it just like the cart drawer. And without any more talking, let's just get to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard in here. And I have here down team, which is the one I do demonstrations on. All the videos I do demonstration on down team because it's the most used one and also is the most requested one. But if I scroll down in here, I have every other free most used teams, which is refresh, spotlight, taste, sense, and trade. And if you are wondering why is that, because I do try each call on each trick on my channel on all of these teams behind the scenes. I don't do that in the video, so I don't board people because like it's seven or six teams. I only do demonstration on down team. But just to make sure that it works for all of them, I do actually try all of my tricks on all of these teams. So I'd make sure that it works for them as well. So even if you're not using down, using one of these, it should work for you just fine. And even if it didn't, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. And I just have to say this in the beginning, so I give you a peace of mind. So you would know that it works for you just fine because you're gonna see me doing it on down. And without the way, let's just get to it and show you how to make the menu drawer on the mobile, taking the full page, just like the cart drawer. And this is the Shopify store we do all the tricks on. So everything you see in the Shopify store, I did it in tutorials. Literally everything, every little thing I did it in tutorials. So if you saw anything in the Shopify store that you liked and you think it looks good and you want to implement it in your Shopify store, it's already been done because once it's here, that means the video is already done and posted and provided the code as well for free. So again, if you saw anything you liked, check out the channel. But what I'm talking about in this video is this one. Let me switch to the mobile. Here we go, uh, 14 Pro Max, yeah, it's good. So if I click on the menu here, as you can see, it does show this and it doesn't cover the whole page. It only covers like a, a specific part of the page. Some other teams does not even cover like the sides from here. It covers maybe half or a little bit over half. So in this video, I will show you how to make it just like the card drawer and it cover the whole page in here. No worries. So we will keep this page open, do the trick, come back and see it in action. So get back to Shopify dashboard. After that, click on the three dots on left of customize and click on edit code. Then it will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. And in here, we need to find the specific file instead of looking at the folder. Simply use the search bar in here. And again, I have to mention this again. So it's going to be either base.css or team.css or style.css. One of them base.css or team.css or style.css most of the teams now they use base.css and mine in this case it's base i'm gonna type in base and here it is click on it it will show you a bunch of code in here again scroll all the way down let me drag this file down and also make sure it ends with .css that's really important and in here we need to create some space because we're gonna pass in some code 
and to get uh, to create that space simply click front of the last thing which is in this case is closing bracket uh, click enter enter sorry click enter on your keyboard and here we go we have a completely new line to paste in our code and to get that code you need to hire a developer pay him with 24 hours i'm just joking scroll down the description box and you will see a link name it as code click on it and it will take you to this beautiful page right here with this beautiful code that will do the trick for us so this code will actually fix this issue and make the menu drawer for the mobile taking the full page just like the card drawer so select the whole code make sure to select the closing brackets as well at the end and right click and copy and get back in here and paste it at the bottom of the file in here after that click on the save button we will wait for a couple of seconds okay it will get back to the Shopify store let me do a reminder so you can see how it looks you see how it looks let's just reload the page and if I click on menu now check it out taking the full page as you can see it covered in the header only the announcement bar that's left if you want to also remove this announcement bar let me know but like this looks way better as you can see if I close it back again back again looks good right and that's how you make the menu drawer on the mobile taking the full page just like the card drawer on your Shopify store and if you have any questions make sure to drop on below but for now I take my job but it's done so thanks for watching catch you on the next one